Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In this particular video, I'm going to show you how to manufacture the car shampoo gel. Okay, it's a full manufacturing session. As you can notice, we do have all ingredients here available. So make sure that you remain tuned till the end so that you can learn this. If you're stopping by the channel for the first time, make sure that you subscribe. Smash that like button for me. Also consider to drop us a comment below. Before moving further on, I'll quickly introduce this to you, okay? It's a book that I recently published. It's on detergent and household cleaning product manufacturing, okay? This is a tool that can help you to take your business to the next level. For you to get the book, there's a link into the description box, okay? You can just click on it, then access the book. We've made it accessible and affordable for everyone. That's it. Let's get back to our main topic, okay? As I said earlier on, into this particular video, I'm going to show you how to manufacture the car shampoo gel, okay? How is the video going to be structured? We'll first give the formulation, okay? Whereby we're going to state ingredients, give their respective ratios. From there, I will introduce the ingredients to you, then do the mixing. Here we go. Into this particular video, we're going to manufacture 500 ml of car shampoo gel. What are the ingredients we need and their ratios? We need water. The amount of water should be 370 ml. Silicon oil, 5 ml. Sless, 25%, 75 ml. CDE, 40 ml. Dye QS. QS that stands for quantity sufficient, okay? Then salt, 10 grams. That's it. Here we go, okay, I will quickly introduce the rose to you, then we'll do the mixing. This is water, okay, this is silicon oil, then we do have slash 25%, we have CDE, it's enough for manufacturing, okay, since I need about 40 minutes. We have dye, I'm using the yellow sunset the sunset yellow dye, also called orange dye. Then um, salt, of which I still need to measure, which is uh, our thickening agent, okay? Now let us get to the mixing. The first ingredient here is water. It should be 370 ml. I've already measured this. Let me get the mixing back here to the forefront. Okay, 370 ml. The next ingredient, it's a silicon oil. I need five mils. Okay, I'll use my measuring cylinder. That's five mils. Okay, make sure you mix very well and the current ingredient must be dissolved before you add the next one. Silicone will help for the shining and wax effect, okay? Remember that it's a polishing agent, silicone oil. The next ingredient, it's less 25%. We need 75 ml. Okay. 75 ml. I have a measuring cylinder. I'll measure 75 ml. That's 75 ml. Mm -hmm. 
need to stir thoroughly. Stay very well. The next ingredient is CDE, which is our foam booster. I need 40 minutes for this session. It's enough, okay? It will make 40 minutes. Forty minutes. It's somewhere here. Somewhere here. Okay. Here we go. It's even more. We remove a bit. That's forty minutes. Then we do the mixing. You can also add perfume, that is optional. About 0.1% of the total volume. The okay, well, next thing to add is the dye. Quantity sufficient, okay? According to how you want your product to look. Dyes are concentrated, make sure you don't put too much. They are highly concentrated. Next ingredient to add is uh, next and last actually is the salt. I need 10 grams of salt. I'll switch on my scale. I tie it. I need 10 grams. I'm at 7 gram. That's 10 gram. It's showing 11 now. I need 10. That's 10 gram. Okay. There is a secret. When you when you come to salt, you 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 don't just have to pour everything. No, you can be pouring this gradually while stirring until you get the thickness that you need okay then you can stop even if you don't pour the whole salt let me put some i'll stir and see yeah you see how it's getting thick now okay nice mixture but still you have to give it time to still need to give it time to mature okay See how nice the gel is. Okay, you make sure that you stay very well and you give it time to mature and also give it time for the foam to settle for about 24 hours. Yeah, then you can do the packaging. That's it.
I've just shown you how to manufacture the cash shampoo gel, okay? Comes out so nice. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel. Remember that there is a lot to learn from here, okay? And I want you to be part of the learning journey. Why not? So that you can consider adding value to yourself. As I said earlier on, consider getting the book, okay? There's a link into the description box. You can just click on it, then access the book. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel and see you on the next video.